One of the most popular places to take a picture in Colorado Springs was actually a hot spot for tourists a hundred years ago. Not much has changed, we're finding out. We're learning about a fun-filled fact in our city's history every week to celebrate our sesquicentennial. Today, our Josh Helmuth shows us who started the biggest photo op at Garden of the Gods more than a century ago and why, at first, it was very controversial. Garden of the Gods was privately owned land at the turn of the century. It was eventually donated to the city by the Perkins family, except for one small but very epically important piece. All the land surrounding Balanced Rock. That used to be owned by a guy named Paul Gerke, and it was his mission to make a hefty profit. He operated a photo studio right next to Balanced Rock, and he charged tourists to take, have their photograph taken on a burrow. Balanced Rock was a tourist trap for decades. Having your picture taken here, even before many had cars, was one of the most popular things for tourists to do here. But the business made Gerke wildly unpopular and wildly unhappy. When personal cameras became more popular and affordable, Gerke then built a fence around Balanced Rock because he wanted to solely make money off of Balanced Rock. And angry locals tore down the fence, and he rebuilt the fence, and they tore it back down. Gerke's gimmick was impeding traffic. Lawsuits dragged on for decades before he finally gave in to the city of Colorado Springs. And finally, in the 1930s, they purchased Paul Gerke's land, they opened it up to the public, and they made that part of Garden of the Gods Park. Josh Helmuth, News Channel 13, Colorado Springs.